common go-to move for her. Not an easy oh. one. Great look inside Shelly to her fellow Aussie, Isabel Moore. She felt like she didn't have to carry the same load. Still shooting good from the floor this year, but back in the starting lineup for Jasmine Powell and Bourne going to work again in the paint. And it gave her so much confidence to have a game like that where she rebounded well, shot the ball well. Jazz Shelly knocking out the three, speaking of shooting the ball well. And that's what she does. Three ball handlers on the floor and Sam Hybe, Jazz Shelly, and Ashley Scoggin. All three have played point guard at one point or another for the Huskers. So that gives them so many good options driving to the paint. Too much time for Shelly. And it's interesting because Jazz Shelley is very close friends with Izzy Bourne on Nebraska. In fact, she had a down between as Isabella Craven scored the bucket. She played in a sweet 16. She had uh, Sabrina Inescu to learn from as Scalia tries a difficult three. Drains it. She loves that shot. That's within her range. Shot clock running down again on the Gophers. Caroline Stranding new into the game as he's so cool. Winters looking for her first shot and she drains it coming off a 17 20 point output against UNC. Scalia known for her hours put in in the gym, the shots she put up, so she can do just that in a moment like this. Two of the best shot blocking guards in the Big Ten going up against each other. Born a difficult post move. That's what we saw her do in the first quarter. Distributors, the playmakers, the passers who they have. It is a dream. And here Bella Cravens is going to take it all the way on the fast break. She's got a huge smile. Doesn't happen all that often for the post. Post players love when they have the opportunity just to pretend that they're under six feet. It wasn't quite coast to coast, but it was close enough. And another fast break opportunity for the 6-3 forward, Bella Cravens. Another situation where the Huskers looking very prepared prepared for that inbound pass. Scoggin banks in the three. It's the Big Ten and three-point shooting percentage, 42%. No open threes for Minnesota. Lob inside to Cravens, who continues her terrific play in the paint. And it's back to an eight-point deficit for Minnesota. Sissoko playing like a guard right now, knocking it down from out there. But look at the pace of play that Jazz Shelley can play with. Pushes the ball, understands tempo. Scalia into Misha, the Big Ten freshman of the week. Goes to work. Two minutes to go in the third quarter. 10 seconds on the clock, a nice pick and pop, and Sissoko will drain it. Minnesota has gotten that every single time. Under a minute to go here at the barn in the third quarter, lots of physical defense on the perimeter, and Sissoko will attack and kisses it off glass for the Gophers. Yeah, Shelly, difficult cross-court pass, and Hybe slowing it down. Ivy looked right at Hubbard and splashed it right in front of her. Nebraska's had a lot of perseverance in this game. Minnesota has not led since it was 2-0. Nebraska has been able to maintain that deficit. But here is Scalia getting closer once again. That ball was tipped, but saved. Scalia, step back. She has Scalia, she's got a good look, and she goes all the way. She is fired up. Deep in the post for Cravens, and she goes off glass. Absolutely, Minnesota has trailed by 13 points. They trailed by 10 multiple holes they've had to dig out of, and they've done it with players like that. Patty Sissoko can't be taking logo shots with 15 seconds on the shot clock this close of a game. Sam Ivey attacking Helgren. That time she gets the roll at a huge moment. The Minnesota native who says she loves playing in this building. The Huskers have led for the vast majority of this game as Ivey attacks and gets the big finish late for the Huskers. Scalia 
taking time getting it up the floor. Only five seconds left. Sissoko will launch a three. Misha with the rebound. And she should get that before the buzzer, but Nebraska will start out their Big Ten season with a win.